We do what we can. Cheap metal window blinds tinkle out their melancholy song as he peers through. The blinds, like the glass, have been cleaned halfway up. Dust and oil and grime coat the higher elevations like clouds on peaks. The wheels on his chair prevent him leaning closer, but he can still see the bench under the trees, across the street. It has become his television. The black box on the wall only speaks of ventilators and crowded hospital hallways and temporary morgues. But the bench is a stage on which he still watches the players strut. If his husband were here, he'd spin stories about every one of them, regale him with imaginary dramas and improbable comedies till this quarantine hell was only dinner theater. But he is not here. A stroke put him in the nursing home and now they too are trapped apart. He watches two joggers arrive at the bench, bending over their knees, stretching their hamstrings. They came from opposite directions, but he fancies they linger, stretching again and again. He wonders if they are talking to one another behind their masks. He drops the blinds when the door buzzes, wheels over to let the home care nurse in. He pretends he does not see her red-rimmed eyes or the tracks of tears retreating beneath her mask. Before she leaves, he gives her a drawing he has made of a robin on the windowsill. <laughs>